We've had a great time catching both large and smallmouth bass today. We got quite a few of the largemouth fishing crankbaits and fishing out in the open, but around weed beds and weed lines in about eight to 12 feet of water. But we also got quite a few fish using plastic grubs. Now, one of the ones that produced really well is the swim fish from Lunker City. And you can see I've got this one rigged up on one of those finesse heads. And uh, it's about the four inch long one, three and a half inch. And it's perfect because it has that tail action that goes from side to side. When we decided to go for smallmouth, we were getting them on grubs as well on the bottom, the swim fish, but we also did well fishing the tubes. So here's one rigged up. You can see this one's a little bit darker color. This one is called a pumpkin seed, which is a traditional color for a tube. Now, I've got to tell you that the tube jigs that we were using actually have rattles in them. So you see how tapered this jig is? It has a 60 degree offset eye and it has that uh, little bit of a like a brass or copper tube and inside there are rattles. So we inserted that right up the middle of the tube and fished them right along the bottom. Now one of the reasons that I like that offset eye is that when you pull it the actual head of the tube comes up and rides over the rocks. 